today I have a set of medium to heavy weights. I've got tens. Um, if you don't have a set of weights, find two items. Fill water bottles. Don't let this be your excuse not to do this workout. Okay, so we're going to take just about a minute here. Kind of warm up. Kick the feet up high. Get stretch that all out. Give me three. Get all the way up. Last two. Kick that foot all the way up. Two. Pull your abdominals in. Last one each side. And reach it right here. Rotate through your waist. This rotation is going to be important as we are going to work through those love handles and lower back section with our weight. So give me five all the way. Four. Three. Two. Take it up. Good. I always like to stretch that upper back. Plus, this is a full body, so we're going to be working everything. And I want everything moving. Okay, so like I said, we just got about 15 more seconds for this warm-up. Get knees nice and wide. If you need longer, you know my rule of thumb. Take it. Hit pause on me. Good. My knees are wide. They're not up front. They're to this side. Good. Give me four. All the way. Three. Two. Last one. And jack it out for 20 seconds. And this will end up our end our warm-up. So that's where you can hit pause if you need longer. Good. All the way up. You got it. Okay, last four, three, two, and done. Okay, so I'm grabbing my set of heavy-ish items. I'm going to go kind of sideways here so you can see my angle. So my shoulders are back. That is so important. Don't start here. Start nice and tall. Shoulders back, abs in. You're going to take both, feet over, both hands over to your left. You're going to roll that right arm up. Both over to the left, right. Row your left. So you're rowing that inside arm, okay? So the arm alternates. Abdominals are in. I'm not going to lie. We're here for two minutes. So you're alternating arms. Lead with a nice flat chest. Don't do this. I see this so often, and that's going to make your back sore, not strengthen. All right, shoulder back. Here we go. Let's get to work. Get all the way up. Take your time. My legs are wider than my hips, okay? So don't stand like this. That's going to change it. I want your feet wide. So you're getting this lean here. Beautiful. Abdominals in. Hold that core tight. Beautiful. Good. All the way up. Keep those shoulders back. Pull those abdominals in. I'm going to keep reminding you, okay? Because I don't want you sloppy on these. It's so important to keep that form. So pull those abdominals in. Beautiful. Okay, keep it going. All the way down. Shoulders back. Chest up. You got this. Keep it going. Beautiful. Okay, all the way. Keep it going. Down over. Keep it going. Woo! Keep that back flat. Are those shoulders back? Hip pause me. Check in the mirror. If you can keep a nice flat back, but this is as far as you can go, that's okay. I'd rather you shorten your range of motion than got farther and got like this. Okay, see that difference? That's going to be the difference in wearing your back out and strengthening your back. We're strengthening it, right? Okay, come on. You got this. 10 seconds. Abdominals in. Good. Last four. We're going to go down to the floor. Three, two. Okay, you can keep your set. I'm going to go one since mine are heavier. Feet out nice and long. I'll give you some modifications. My feet are slightly wider than my hips. I'm going to roll it up. Nice straight leg, okay? Here we go. Three, two, and go. I'm alternating legs. Now, what you can do to modify is bring a bent knee in. Okay. If that's still a little too intense, go right here. Good. Just coming up off the shoulder blades, bringing the knee in or a straight leg, but I'm not coming up as high. So you've got options. Keep it going. Woo! Feeling good, right? 
I'm gonna keep it going. Abdominals in. So because my feet are wide, give me a little bit of a turn as I come up. So I'm gauging a little more obliques than if I was just coming straight up in front. Beautiful, come on, 10 seconds. We're coming up. Last four, three, two, and up. Okay. We are going to jam squat. Short 30 seconds. Here we go. Three, two, go. Now, if you don't want to jump, step it. Okay. Now, make sure, though, you're stepping wide enough that you're not like this with the knees over the toes. Keep it going. Keep it going. Okay, you got it. Keep moving. Down to those legs. Last one and rest. All right. Grab that heavy item, heavy items, or weights, whatever you're using. Here's our second round. Feet nice and wide. Three, two, and go. Good. Over. Shoulders back. Good. Abdominals in. Beautiful. Woo. You got this. Cut it all the way down. Back up. Shoulders back. Leave with a nice flat back. My legs are long. I'm not squatting it. I'm not lunging it. Keep the legs straight. This is all from your waistline. Good. Woo. Good. Shoulders back. Keep it going. Be a little shorter this round. So if you got just about yeah, 30 seconds, just about that. A few extra. Whew. Keep it going. Come on, shoulders back. Take a second. Remember, if your form is here, that's okay. Keep it where you are in control. Going full range of motion but getting sloppy, you're losing the work. Okay, keep it going. 15 seconds less than. Whew. Feeling good. We're going to go down to the mat. Last three, two, and down. Good. I'm keeping one of my heavy items. Feet a little lighter than your hips. There we go. Good to work. Now remember, you got your options that need to modify. Or maybe you don't want to come all the way up. So you go straight leg. But I'm still bringing that leg up wide. I'm still turning the upper body coming off of both shoulders. Good. Or even modify with a bent knee. That's going to put even less pressure in the back. Good. You got this. Beautiful. Beautiful. Come on. 15 seconds. Give it to me. We're gonna rush and twist. And rest, okay. Rush and twist. If rush and twist is uncomfortable on your lower back, take it to the ground for a bicycle. I'll show you that in just a second, but let's get started. Here we go. You got it, woo! Keep it going. Now if this bothers your back, Bring it here and cross. Now watch if your bicycle crisscrossing in place of that, that you're staying off both shoulder blades. It's not just a roll, all right? Up, off the shoulder blades. Nice long leg, all right? Keep that going. Hit where you wanna be. Uh-oh, we're losing our timer, keep going. I'm gonna find a better timer system. All right, keep it going, keep it going. Come on, abdominals in, sit tall, shoulders back. Get to 
rest at the end of our 15 minutes. Okay, keep it going. Woo! Remember, you don't want to jump. Step it. I'm opening up the toes a bit when I jump or step, okay? And then again, make sure you're stepping wide enough so you're not lunging and you're not getting that baby sweat. Less than 15 seconds. Woo! Last three. We're grabbing those heavy items and done. Okay, grab those heavy items. Last one of these. Feet nice and wide. Shoulders back. Abdominals in. Here we go. Nice flat back. Let's go. Last one. Beautiful. You got it. Woo. Keep it going. Shoulders back. Lean with that chest. This is not lean with the chest. My shoulders need to be back. Okay, I need to keep a strong posture all the way down. This is our last round of this. And we're down to the floor. You got it. Keep the shoulders back and those abs in. Good. We're in the home stretch. Let's go. Come on, keep it going. Keep it going. Woo. You got 15 seconds right here on this move. Okay, we're gonna hustle down to that mat. For our last roll, weighted little roll up. Give me one bar right here. Beautiful, one weight down. Bring your other weight with you. Let's go, hustle up, hustle up, and go. No time to waste. You can modify. You got your options, your bent knees. Or so let's come up off the shoulder blades. Straight leg or bent knee. You pick. So let's go. Let's get these done. Right here, you got 15 seconds. previous a little bit of rest. That's our best result for toning, building muscle. Good, come on, keep it going. Woo! You got it. Woo! Keep it going. Keep it going. Right here, 10 seconds. Nice job. I don't know about you. My 
heart rate's going. So I'm gonna make sure to walk around the house as it slows down. Don't just go sit down. Don't just go stand still, okay? You want everything to slow down and you don't want that blood to pull in your legs and your arms, okay? So keep everything moving, doesn't have to be vigorous, but just walk and move. You know, go hydrate. You know to go refill up. As always, thanks for joining me. You guys, I love it. I have so much fun with you guys. I hope you're enjoying this new challenge. And go have a happy, healthy day. Make sure you hit subscribe.